Can we just take a moment to appreciate this fuzzy blanket hoodie because I'm living my best cozy life right now. Hey guys, my name is Haley and today I'm going to be filming the books I'll probably never read tag. I was tagged to do this by Oshina from Oshina Gotta Read Them All and there's only like five or six questions so we're just going to get right on into it. The first question is a really hyped book that you're just not interested in. And there's a lot of those for me, but the one I'm gonna go with is Vengeful by V.E. Schwab. I did read Vicious a couple years ago now. It was fine. I liked it at the time, but I know if I reread it, I probably wouldn't like it. So I have no interest in the sequel, which this answer could have also gone for the second question, which is a series you won't start or a series you won't be finishing. There's plenty of series that I won't start because I'm already in the middle of way too many series. But series I won't be finishing, I've talked about a lot of these before. Akatar series, I'm not gonna read A Court of Wings and Ruin or any of the other ones probably. Winner's Curse trilogy, Darker Shade of Magic, I DNF that first book. <laughs> The Monsters of Verity duology, I DNF'd the second book even though it's just a duology. Six of Crows, I actually already unhauled that book. And more recent one actually, this one's a little bit different. But I've decided to DNF even though I said I was probably gonna read the next book when it comes out. That's, I don't know who I'm kidding, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> and that is City of Brass by S.H. Hackerbordy. I realized that I actually really didn't like this. I think I gave it three stars. It's really not a three star. It's like a two star for me. So yeah, I'm not going to continue with this series. I don't know who I was kidding when I said I was. Question number three is a classic that you're just not interested in. And uh, there's a lot of classics I'm really not interested in, but specific ones, they're not even that specific. It's like an author. I'm not that interested in Jane Austen. I've read Pride and Prejudice, didn't like it really don't have an interest in that era, like Regency era, I'm not Victorian era, I'm not into that type of thing most of the time, so I probably won't read any more Jane Austen. Question number four is any genres you've never read? I don't think so, because I read pretty widely. The only thing I can think of is like romance, because I don't, not gonna go there, not interested. <laughs> I'm also really not interested in new adult because I don't like what that genre usually does with that age group as Oshina even mentioned in hers. They like assume everybody in that age group is obsessed with specific things romantically especially and I'm just not, I don't agree with that at all. And then question number five is a book on your shelf that you'll probably never actually read. The one I came up with one I'm still not sure if I will read or not is the John Adams biography by David McCullough. I saw someone who had also read the Hamilton biography talk about this one. Also, this book is really heavy. This is unnecessarily heavy. But I'm just not as interested in John Adams as I was in Hamilton. And I know this is a good biography. I've heard good things about this author, but I just don't know if I care enough. So yeah, that is my books I'll probably never read tag. I only have two of them to hold up, but thank you all for watching and I will see all of you guys next time.